Looky, looky here. I believe I kept my little old clips from the other day. June the 5th, 2015. Flow's over, people. Let me show you what I mean. Took them a while to get fired up, but here they are. So, what little they got in the hives, I can dry it now. And I'll let them dry it and, and pull it. It's about like clockwork. We had a rain, I don't know, a couple days. It lines up just about right with the previous two years. Uh, 2013, it cut off June of, June of night. Last year, it cut off the 1st of June. And so we right on it. I'm going to start feeding some of them. And, uh, I got some doubles that's building up, double mediums. I'm going to feed them and try to keep them building until the sour wood flow and then super them. And only take what's stored in the supers. Uh, a lot of this stuff I need to keep a, a trickle of sugar going in them. But like the big stacks until I get everything pulled off of them. And, see what's what. I may feed them just a little bit before the sour wood flow after I get the honey off uh, to be sure that they don't break the brood because they'll shut down right now. Right now all those queens and those big ones they will absolutely stop laying. Matter of fact you can give them about two weeks and look in there and you'll think it's queenless and wonder what in the world happened. But she's still in there. She just shut down. Good ones will. All right flows off until well I just took pictures of sour wood buds down there I should have took video but, uh, flows over people till about June the 20 25th something like that if that don't get rained out 2013 it probably did um, I wasn't set up for honey in 13 so see this behavior that slipping around right there two or three up that's Robert's don't belong to that box. Flows over. That's that. Well, a little sucker flew. I'll try to get a, a good video of him. I just about had him, then he took off. Little gold finches don't sit still long. Huh? Any finch for that matter. That a pretty little bird. Must be a little pal. Need to fix up Granddaddy's birdhouse. I don't know, one's setting up pal. Wait a minute. Got it out of frame. Ain't about to rot and fall over. No flow, peoples. The flow is over for spring. We're going to have a little fun under the shed here. June the 5th, 2015. I noticed signs of it the other day, though. Um, so here we are. I had... Uh, oh, that's some burr comb and stuff. It was in the... You know, I froze it to keep it wax moth maggots out of it so some of these bees will be getting a little cold trying to eat that right now but. and what from the Danville cut out and the church cut out right there random stuff and need to go in there and get my cappings from my first little honey spinning a couple weeks ago there's some of them here and get them dried Let's see, I'm going to take some, I don't know, probably, it's probably going to be about 10 or 15 deep frames of honey out of my nukes. I'm going to sit right here and let them rob and recycle. Most of those big stacks will be taking it back home anyway, so uh, that'll get stored and I can spend that. Oh, that'll be pure spraying honey. Now, the ones that I'm feeding right now, they... Um, I do not want them to shut down. I got, I got some plastic cell and 
and some of my mediums I'm testing that and anyway getting them I want them to draw out those doubles that one happens to be a triple and uh, I want them uh, I want them blowing up in about three weeks so I can super them to collect sourwood honey um, most of what I'm feeding them is going to go directly in the brood bellies if you put a quarter 50% syrup on them twice a week that uh, that essentially vaporizes in the thin air you don't hardly see it stored on a box uh, that size I don't never have you got to really dump it to them to make them store it but yes I need to get about 10 hives built up the sourwood flow give them about two supers of dry but drawn comb a piece and, uh, that works good for that flow because it's a little it's a little mild but it lasts lasts a couple weeks or better and the drier the better surprisingly last year I could stick my hand all the way up to my wrist down in cracks in the yard out there where we've been driving a tractor across it and honey flow like a river <laughs> so anywho spring flows over people time to tote some jars I reckon yes people I do believe the flow is over pretty decent little indication of it I got some bees out here this year too you better well believe um, I bet a super cow honey wouldn't last. I bet they could have it dry in an hour. Because they just now figuring out this is here. Alright, well that's that. Sound no gets old, people. Yeah.